Hang on tight, Jim. We're going to beat the final boss this time. Don't mess this up for us this time. So when do you plan on cleaning this room? When I'm not online. Oh? And when will that be? You know you've been saying that for the past few days, this room is filthy. Well if it's bothering you so much, then why don't you clean it yourself? I'm sorry? This is not my mess. You need to start being responsible with the way you take care of a room. Whatever. Hey, I was playing that. Are you not hearing me? This room is disgusting. Look, there's trash everywhere, and there's a rat in here, and you have purple fries next to your video game? If you love your XOX, you'd treat it with more respect. Don't you have a room to clean? Leave me alone. Justin, get off your lazy butt and clean up this disgusting room. G-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-R-
If you think you are going to win that new room for yourself big sis, then you're going down, ha, huh, in your dreams. Good luck trying to build up that mess in your permanent old room. Oh it's on. Not until you clean your room. Let's start with our first challenge, the speeding treadmill. Hello and welcome to Vyond's Ultimate Betting Challenge Deluxe. What the? Who are you? Who am I? I'm Carl Datney. I'm the host of many game shows, such as this one. Game show? But we just made this up. Coincidence, right? Well, I think we can do this on our own. Vyond's Ultimate Betting Challenge Deluxe is our trademark. If you're doing this challenge individually, we could sue you. Hi, my name is Justin Doe. And I'm Emily Doe Jr., but call me Emma. And I'm your host, Carl Datney. Welcome to Vyond's Ultimate Betting Challenge Deluxe. These two are here today to debate who wins the brand new room in their house. This attic looks very nice indeed, yes. What the, Carl Datney, in my house? What are you doing here? Your kids are on TV. Let's see who wins the new room. Wait, you don't have permission to have my kids on television. What if I give you $2,000? Sweet, I'm a go watch the episode right now. All right, let's go back to the gym and begin this challenge. All right, Justin, you suggested this challenge, right? What do you call it? I call it the speeding treadmill. For this challenge, both the contestants must run on this treadmill at the fastest speed level. Whoever falls off first loses, giving the opponent one point. Um, Justin, you sure this is safe? Seems a little dangerous. Ah! What's wrong? Scared. Well, it looks like I won by default. Turn it on. Ready? Run! These kids have a lot of energy, not even I can run that fast. Oh, Emma, you look burnt out. No. Why uck? Yes, I win. Ha ha ha. Oh, I would you look at that, Justin wins the first round. You may have won the first challenge Justin, but prepare for the cannon launch. What is this, Angry Birds? This isn't a slingshot. In this challenge. Hey, I'm the host here, let me do the explaining. In this challenge, these kids must launch themselves to that ocean. Whoever launches farther the points you win. This drone camera will capture how far they launched. Hey, why are you beating yourself yellow? Because we need to know where we land. The paint will mark our spot. Now grab a bucket. Okay, let's do this. Um, ladies first? Are you kidding? No way, you first. But this was your idea. Well if you die then I will back out. Come to think of it, I could win by default. If I die, I will haunt the new room. Alright, 3, 2, 1, launch. Time to land. And just like that, Justin landed 45 miles. Looks like it's safe. All right, Carl, fire away. Wow, this is actually kind of fun. Yeah, fear me world? Ha 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 ha. And on your right, we have the mysterious floating wall. After 36 years, we still to this day question how this wall still hovers and why it hovers. Damn it. Oh no, Emma was 5 points off from Justin, and result of 40 miles. Justin wins yet another round. Ha! Two in a row. That room is as good as mine. Ugh. This isn't over. Mommy look, she peed in the water. Ha 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 It's ha. yellow paint, freaking yellow paint, g r r r r r r r Oh, um, hey Doug. What's up? Hey Tom. 
So, um, may I ask why you are here? Well, I actually heard you're giving away a free room, so I was wondering. The old office room for one of my kids? Yeah, it's theirs now. Well, not yet. Your kids are still debating who gets it. How did you even know that? Because they're on Tatney's game show. Everybody's watching it. Yeah, I think it's kinda cool but it's a little frustrating. They're keeping all the equipment at my house. Anyways, as I was saying, can I have it? Huh? The room. I want the room. No, it's in my house. So what? Just let me have it. No Doug, why do you even need it? My house only has four rooms. A living room, a kitchen, a bathroom, and a bedroom. That doesn't answer my question. Well, I've always wanted a rock star room. Doug what? I'm going to be a solo rock star, and so I need that room to practice. Why solo? Well, I don't have any friends. I don't know why though. Seriously? You're a lunatic. You break into people's houses and make yourself at home. You destroy public property. You act like a complete menace. Must I go on? You don't like Tatney's equipment in your house, right? If you let me have the room, the episode will have no choice but to be cancelled. Carl Datney will then leave. So come on, it's a win-win deal. No, no way am I giving you that room. Oh come on, please, I just want the room. GRRRR get out of here you weirdo. No, my room will Are you ready for the City Link Race? For this third challenge, Justin and Emma will sprint to the flag goal from the other side of the city. The winner gets a point. Looks like our referee is here. So why am I refing you again? We're doing a challenge to see who wins the new room in our house. So you're just racing? Nope, it's the third out of five challenges. I whatever. On your mark? Get set! Go! Give up Emma, I'm going to win three times in a row. Nope. Your streak is going to break. Ha ha. Hey, GRRRRRRR. Oh hi, Justin. Sarah, I need your bike. Or what? Um, hey look. You're on TV. Oh my god. Hi, I'm Sarah. Go subscribe to my Insta- Sorry Sarah. I have a race to win. Hey, Justin. Ugh. That's not even my bike. What am I going to tell Riley? Sweet. She has a color-changing bike. What? How are you pedaling so fast? Hey, get the hell off my car. Yuck. Looks like I'm going to win. Brad, the key to balancing the burger is to skate with an empty mind. How is that even possible? Emma, are you okay? Never mind that, I need your skateboard. If you want my skateboard, you have to balance this burger on your head too. No more games, here I come. No. Stay back. Uh, Ugh, finally. Looks like Emma wins the race. Ha 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 ha, I won. Hey, no fair, Doug hit me. Well it's still a win, I'm not running that far again. And Doug, what are you even doing here? Neither of you are getting that room, it's as good as mine, so I'm joining your challenge. Oh god it's him again. You can't do that. Oh I'm doing it, you brats are going to lose. Do I suspect a new contestant? Will Doug join the challenge? No. Get out of here. Yeah, fine, but I still want that room. He isn't getting the room. Well, can I have it? Get, Get out, out of, of here, here Caesar. Caesar. 
I'm just kidding. Get ready to taste the chefy dish. There will be three judges, Tom Doe, Emily Doe, and the mystery chef. He's well known on television. Justin and Emma will create a dish to the judge's liking. Whoever makes the best dish wins the challenge and will receive one point. Wait, so we're just gonna cook? Not just cook, Justin. Whoever makes the best dish wins the challenge. Well, what do we cook? Anything you want. Think of it as your signature dish. You only have one hour, so get cooking. Your timer starts now. Um, Justin, your dish is on fire. Thank you. It's a masterpiece if I do say so myself. No, I mean it's actually on fire. What? Oh my god, wow. I, 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 Little did he know, I turned his burner on super high. Ha ha. Just a few more minutes. Ha, well I'm already done. Mine will be completed by the time the timer runs out. Meanwhile, your dish will get cold. Crap, I didn't think of that. And done. Time's up. Come to the dining room and present your dish. Now, for the final result of this challenge, both the contestants must share their dish to their parents and the mystery chef. A higher score ranking will be rewarded with one point. All right, Justin, you're first. I present to you both spaghetti with blue sauce. The sauce could use a little more seasoning, as for the noodles. Um, is this burnt? It's also a little bland. Maybe I didn't put enough garlic salt on it. Son, you've burnt it. Garlic salt won't save this. I think we'd give this ranking a 5. Maybe this will take out the blandness in your taste buds. My dish is a stack of pancakes with dark chocolate syrup. The flavor is delicious. A little too sweet though, it's like a mouthful of sugar. I say we give it an 8. Ha, 3 more points than you means I win. Wait, we still have the mystery judge. Who's the mystery judge? Ugh, they taste like crap. You both lose, so the room is mine. Five points to Doug. Doug, I said no. Get out. My rock star room, Tom. I need it. How did you even get inside? Wait, what happened to Chef Bacons? Hey, get me out of here, Doug, please. I don't want to die. <laughs> GRRR, get out or I will call the cops. Ugh, I will get what I want sooner or later jerks wait at least tell me what you did with i'm probably gonna get sued after this well i still win keep your fingers crossed though you both have two points the last challenge will determine our winner now since you both picked a challenge i will create the last challenge so looks like we're tied i wonder what carl's last challenge will be emma no no way I won't lose this room, not over some games. Girl, chill out. You're acting crazy. These challenges aren't even that extreme. Well, except for the Canon 1. What? Not extreme? But they're supposed to be. Nah, the cooking one was a little lame. Lame? Okay then, give me one second. Oh, hey Emma, what's with the rope? Wow. Your sister sounds crazy. Get out of here, Doug. Ha 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 ha. We still have one more challenge. You know what it is? Oh no. Oh yes. I don't like where this is going. Challenge number five, the skydive. Emma, no, this is too much, even for you. I don't care, I want that room Justin. It's not worth dying. We won't die, we have parachutes, whoever pulls their string first loses the last point. Wait, where's Carl got me? You! Why did you tie me up and lock me in a closet? My choice of a fun challenge is through extreme fear, it spices things up, maybe then Justin will appreciate my extreme fun idea. What, you really think this is about the new room? 
No, I'm trying to show you that I can be a fun sister rather than a boring sister. Skydiving won't prove that. Wait, how old are you kids? You have to be at least 21 to do the skydive. 12 is the new 21. Swap the numbers, Carl. Justin, get ready to jump. Emma, stop it. I don't even want the room anymore. This is getting out of hand. If mom and dad found out about this, they'd kill us. Look, why are you even doing all of this in the first place? Well, you know how you say I always boss you around and act too motherly? Yeah. And you know how you call me boring because of it? I mean, I don't really mean it. But you still say it, and sometimes, I feel like you may be right. I don't want people to think I'm lame, I don't want you to think I'm lame sister, so I contacted Carl Dutney, because I knew the betting challenge was actually his game show, that's why he showed up out of nowhere. I thought if we did these challenges for the new room, everybody would think I'm cool. Justin, I I just don't want you to think I am just a boring older sister. Emma, I'm sorry. Sometimes, I just get frustrated when you boss me around, but honestly, I don't think you're boring. You're still my big sister at the end of the day, and you know what, you're the most fun out of anyone. Thank you Justin. But it's overboard that you're doing this for an empty attic. You're right, oh my god. What are we doing, and for what, a stupid room. Keep the room, I quit, you win by default. Are you sure? I'm sure sis. But what about the show? Emma wins by default. Well you heard it here folks, Emma Doe is the winner. Yes, I win. Ha 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 ha. I mean, um, very cool. Alright kids, we will film the rest of the episode back at your house. Do you need a ride back? Nah, we'll be fine. We have our bikes. Very well, I'll meet you there. Sorry this got out of hand. It's fine. It was actually fun while it lasted. Nope, the room is mine. Goodbye. If they're dead, they can't win. Now, it is time to get my equipment to my new room. Wait, the parachute. Emma, pull your string. Even if the challenge was still on, I would have won. Like I said, keep the room. Well, I'm glad you both decided. Looks like the room is yours, Emma. What was your final challenge? Um, well. They forfeit the challenge. They were going to jump off. We sold candy bars to the neighborhood. So later on, Emma, we will move your things too. Hey guys, check it out, isn't my drum set great? Are you kidding me? Okay, who even is this guy? He's been following us all day. What? Jealous? Wait, how are you two still alive? Alive? You tried to kill our kids? Um, well, yes, but it was for a good reason. It was for me to get the room and become a solo drummer. Doug, what is wrong with you? Hey, I need my privacy, so get out of my room. Emily, the steak. Tom, your steak. Doug, catch. Steak, my favorite. But why is it wrong? Justin, go get Marks. Marks? Who is Marks? Marks is our dog, and when someone touches his steak, he goes berserk. His steak? <laughs> oh no, what a -M -R -M. Well, that concludes today's show. We'll see you next time for another V. Yon's Ultimate Betting Challenge Deluxe. I'm your host, Carl Batney, signing off. Is it over? Yes, thank you for your service. I left two grand on your table as thanks. Have a good night. Let's never do the V. Yon's Ultimate Betting Challenge Deluxe ever again. Well, don't count on that statement. Okay, let's get Emma's things and move it to the new room. It looks great, I love it. Just one more thing to move out. Well, it's time for bed. Good night, everyone. Enjoy your room, Emma. Good night, sis. Good night. 
somebody please help me. I think I have a concussion. Why?